On June 4, 2009, the UNC Coastal Studies Institute, in conjunction with UNC Chapel Hill's Department of Marine Sciences, performed maintenance and replaced oceanographic equipment in the water located just offshore of Kill Devil Hills, North Carolina. UNC CSI divers replaced an Acoustic Doppler Current Profiler, or ADCP, which provides current and wave speed and direction as part of a nearshore processes and beach hazard study. The goals of this collaborative project are to explore the impacts of nearshore currents and waves on beach morphology and to pinpoint specific local conditions that result in rip current formation. UNC CSI divers removed the ADCP, which has been deployed since last summer, and replaced it with another loaded with fresh batteries. Once at the lab, researcher Greg Dusek will download the data from the ADCP and use it to ground truth and improve models used to predict rip current formation a valuable tool that could be used by area lifeguards, such as the Kill Devil Hills Ocean Rescue, a local partner on the project. Not only does the equipment provide valuable data for scientists, it also provides habitat for a variety of marine life. Sea stars, urchins, and barnacles cover the pod, while fish, such as triggerfish and sheephead, make use of the available food and shelter. The project includes data collected from two ADCPs mounted in the seafloor less than one mile off Kill Devil Hills, regular beach profiles used to map changes in shoreline, and rip current observations made by KDH Ocean Rescue. The results of this project will help us improve our understanding of surf zone processes, such as rip currents and strong shore break events, through the analysis of surf zone observations, nearshore bathymetry, and directional wave data.